Hi, today I'm going to talk about the original classic Star Wars. This movie came out in 1977. The changes the movies were made. So this movie, so this movie starts off with Leia Organa with the with, with the Rebels. So we have two joys, C-3PO and R2-D2. Had to, had, to go, had to go into a escape pod so they can escape from the Empire because R2 has some important information they, for the, so the Empire wants to, to get the plans for the ultimate Death Star so they go to, they go to, the, to a deserted planet of Tatooine and they meet Luke, Luke Skywalker, then later on in the movie, they have this, so Luke looks out the twin sons of Tatooine, and it's a great Star Wars moment, until we meet, then later on in the movie, R2, leaves, leaves the home of Luke, Luke Skywalker, so they say Luke and Pio have to find R2 until they find an old Jedi Master, Obi-Wan Kenobi. Then they go to the then or Big Kenobi, played by Alec Guinness. But it's a really good movie. Man, when this movie came out, it was a like a, like a big hit. That came out in 1977. It's one of the best movies ever. It really brings out that magic feel of this movie. So good to begin with. And in the, it's, it's the first movie directed by George Lucas, who did an amazing job. Then we have the legend himself, John Williams, who did a great job with the music. Without, without this music, I don't know, this Star Wars movie could, could not have been a big hit. But it's a great movie. It's a great movie for kids and adults to love. It's just a great movie to watch. Until we go to Polis Massa Spaceport to the meet. A ruthless smuggler Han Solo and his rookie pirate Chewbacca. So, like, Luke, Fuhio Nasu, and Obi-Wan. Make a deal with the other one, but the other one is blown up by the Empire. So uh, they are, so they are, so they find out that it's no moon. It's a space station. Too big, too big to be a space station. But then they are trapped by the Empire, so they have, so they have to rescue Leia Organa. So they rescue her, then they go to the then they go to go to the cover shoot. Pew, 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 in the cover shoot, fly boy. But I love all the characters the acting. The moments are so iconic and really good. So they so they go to the rebel fleet. So I mean, they go back to the rebel fleet for the for the epic showdown. Between the rebels and the Galactic Empire. And so this so they have to be prepared for the battle. They have to come up with a plan. But it's a really good movie. So this is to take down the death the first Death Star. Luke then Luke's uh, when they're doing the epic showdown. L Luke Skywalker blows up the Death Star and the Han Solo comes down the and says, Yahoo! Come on, kid! Let's blow this thing and go home. And Luke blows up the Death Star. So they go back to the Rebel fleet, and and, and they and the and the Rebel and the Rebels have won the first time, the first time against the Empire. Until we get the end of the movie of the award ceremony. Yeah, cause this is all happy, just celebrating. And that is the end of Star Star Wars. Thank you for making, thank you for watching my review of 
Star Wars.